how I booked a first class ticket for less than the price of an economy class ticket. Hey, how's it going? It's a lot of King, everybody. I just wanted to show you something very interesting here. Uh, this is my first time ever booking an award flight through American Airlines. I recently just got started with their fre frequent flyer program, A Advantage. And here's my situation. I'm flying from Baltimore, Washington to Phoenix um, on March 30th. We got one passenger. Let's do a search. Uh, this is, I've already booked this, but I wanted to kind of show you, show you why this is probably worth it if there's a, a more specific flight that you want to get, a more convenient flight, and pay less in miles in first class than economy class. Okay, so American Airlines gives you economy miles saver, which in this route I could do it for 12.5k miles. And then there's economy anytime. Now, economy anytime lets you pick a much more variety of flights for 30,000 miles. But then there is the business first miles saver, which may I show you is 25,000 miles. And then their pick any basically flight is 55,000. But let's not pay attention to that one. There's this guy, but we're going to come back to that one too. Let's do the cheapest one 12.5K. Let's go see what available flights are available for 12 and a half, 12, 12,500 miles. All right, so it looks like there is a nonstop flight available, but at least at 512 at night, doesn't get out there till 727. There's a flight that leaves at 632 in the morning, connects in Charlotte, and you're in Charlotte for... Good God, that's like, what, 12 hours? Uh, kind of the same, similar thing here. There's very, very, very long connection times, and it's taking you out of Dulles. It's taking you out of DCA. Uh, just really crappy flights. There's really nothing that arrive, takes off in the morning and arrives in Phoenix fairly early. I mean, there are just up to four pages of flights, but these are pretty much the same thing. So it looks like American gives cr the crappier flights. I mean, this one's probably your best one. I mean, at least it's a nonstop flight to the mile saver because it's 12.5K 12 miles. You know, and then I can show you if you look at the economy anytime, look at this, you're getting much more variety of flights, nonstop flights. It's great. Now, so I decided, I'm like, well, let's see what they offer you when you do the business first mile saver. Hey, look at this, 25,000, you can take the 638 flight, nonstop, Baltimore to Phoenix for 25,000. Or you can go to Economy anytime, get the same flight for 30,000 miles. 30,000 miles, 25,000 miles. Which would you do? First class or you can sit in Economy and pay more. Uh-huh. So this is exactly what I booked. I booked a first class seat. Uh, let's see what seats are available. I'll show you which seat I picked. But uh, it's pretty crazy. I wonder if anyone else has taken it. No, 2F. There's plenty of space in this first class cabin, everybody, for everyone to come on board. But yeah, so very interesting. So if you're going to book a reward flight with AA Advantage, uh, check out first class because you might be able to get a better flight for less miles. So just thought I'd share that. Thanks for watching and happy flying.